think it's, it'd be a really good idea if we just go round the, the room and, and introduce ourselves and our role. It all started in June 2012 uh, when Dan Musty approached us and uh, suggested that we might want to get involved in, in, in the project. They'd found a, uh, a World War II diary in Emsworth uh, and Chichester Harbour Conservancy had got hold of the diary. My colleague Ali was um, presented with um, a diary written by a young man who used to live in Emsworth and his diary was recounting um, his story really, what he witnessed during the Battle of Britain. Just the whole way it was written, it was just so evocative of that period, the whole way his family were feeling about the war and he was feeling about it. Um, and I just read this through, I thought we've got to do something more with this. So I was having a chat with Dan Musty one time from Millstream Productions and immediately you could see the, the film aspect of it. Straight away we could see the benefit through the diary of, of how visual um, it could be and, and he was describing um, moments within that diary that, that are of you know massive historical importance. We had to allocate uh, production roles. Uh, so we have the director Lewis Dady, uh, we've got Charlie Schultz, another media student who's the production manager, uh, the camera team, the lighting team, the sound team, uh, they're all media or film students that haven't I got involved when uh, Steve approached me about the project. Uh, I live in Emsworth, so I was really interested in the history. Lewis was involved in research, the writing process. He was, a, you know, he was a key part of the writing team, and went through to, to directing. We had other young people, Charlie Schultz, who became the production manager, and was also heavily involved in PR. So he was working quite closely with the Harbour Conservancy and in promoting the project. We had to put a presentation together after we'd finished all the script writing and, sh and give them a preview of what we'd actually done. Um, we gave a short presentation and then we did a Q&A with them. I went up to London with Ali and Steve and pitched the idea to the Heritage Lottery Fund and uh, yeah, it's been involved from the start so it's nice to see it progress from what it was to how it is now. And then um, we also had a lad called Jack Burns. And he's like one of those guys that um, you don't always notice is there but was absolutely integral to, to this production you know he, he was involved in the writing process he was heavily involved in the pitching and then through production he headed up the lighting day one was a very long shoot I left my house at 7 15 in the morning got back at 7 30 at night I was so nervous on the first day but now I'm getting into the swing of it it's good I'm having a lot of fun doing it and it's really interesting to be on professional set as well Connors at some point through the week probably took every role there is known in film production. I started out at the bottom, at the very low, you know, I was just a mere scrounger at the bottom and then one day I realised I could be more and worked my way up through the levels and um, by the end of the first day, you know, I was helping direct, production assistant, I was no longer a clapper boy, I, I, was, I was the man. Action. Sean's a very interesting character. I mean, throughout the film, we see him develop from he's at the beginning quite uh, childish. He's very fascinated by the planes, but throughout the film, we see him slowly develop until he gets called up by the end, where we have to see him grow up. It's, it's a really interesting role to play. That'll cover us because as eyes it comes around, that yeah. Is that in That's great. Okay, it's perfect. Now. Okay, quite on set. Sound. Ready. Camera. Action. There's a German John. Two of them. Done? Yep. Done. Okay. Good work. I like the <laughs> We had um, a slight problem where Megan was not going to be available for one of the day's uh, shoot and Anna Clayton stepped up and became assistant director. Her and Lewis are fairly friendly, they, they know each other. He recommended Anna to step up into that role and she did a wonderful job. Be quiet on set. 
Sound. Camera. Action. Three, two, one, boom! <laughs> um, yeah, we're really looking forward to the end project as well. Um, it's good to see that all the hard work's actually made something. <laughs> it's been it's been tough, um, but it's been great to be able to go on a real film set. I think it's gone very well so far, if not very cold, but shot-wise and how we've done it, I think it's turned out very well. You know, it's been very cold, but everyone's really powered through it, which is quite good. I'm going to kind of miss being involved in such a project when it's over, but um, no, I've really enjoyed it, so I will be a bit sad. commitment their effort you know they were putting in uh, maybe 10 to 12 hours in a day you know I'm sure the level of commitment will continue right until the end and that the final um, film will be fantastic and I'm yeah really looking forward to, to seeing it <laughs>